Oppression is a state of mind. Okay, let me show you the state of mind quickly and the differences between white colored and black people and where they live, okay? Most colored people live here. Yeah. Yeah. And, and yeah. But this is most, just this children's state of mind. It's not their reality. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, I sit my bed my couch and I give you the tea without giving you the actual tea. Now, talking about oppression, I know Abelung don't like talking about it because it makes them look bad. They want to take credit for the good things, all the wonderful things that ever has happened or things that will ever happen in their lives. They want to take credit for that. They want to take credit for all the good things, but never for the accountability. But they want us to take accountability for the crimes that black people do, for the things that will happen. They want us to take accountability also for the things that they did to us. We must take accountability for that. They don't want the responsibility on of their it's our fault basically that they did but they they did what they do or continue to do what they do because they lack accountability. That's how severe lacking accountability is in the white community. They also have this thing of wanting to appear that they have everything put together like they're so good like if you're so good then if you're so nice then why do you want validation it seems like your nicest stems from me being oppressed me being the bad guy you get to be the good guy and i get to be the bad one all right so for me i'm like i'm looking at this and like they don't like talking about this they don't like talking about it but this video will highlight why they don't like talking about that they don't like taking accountability it will highlight for you and you will learn why oppression is a state of mind okay let me show you the state of mind quickly and the differences between white colored and black people and where they live okay most colored people live here yeah and and yeah but this is most just this children's state of mind it's not their reality it's not the reality it's their state of mind this is this is their state of mind that he's putting in the mirror. Let's move on to black people. This is most a state of mind. This year is a state of mind. Right? This year, yeah, this township here, yeah, there's also a state of mind. This, this oppression that, that they've suffered and their people have suffered for generations upon generations that have caused that they are still here is only because of state of mind. Not because of unequal distribution of services, not because of lack of opportunities to educate themselves, lack of funding to educate themselves, e a, a lack of equality in the job space. Not, it's not because of any of that. It's because of the state of mind that they are here. And yeah, and yeah, and yeah. This year is all a state of mind. Okay, got it. Let's see where white people live quickly. Like Constantia, like Constantia, shout out to your quiet state of mind, eh? Manifestation works. Ah, hello Newlands! Your state of mind is also about fuck! If your manifestation of this, with your mind, you put your mind to it, it'll happen! Shout out C point! CBD! Hey, your state of mind! Empire state of mind, bro! Shout out, shout out, shout out, shout out! CBD! Shout out CBD mindsets! All of you with the mindsets! Kwai! It's got nothing to do with your generational wealth having been stolen from you by other people. It's got nothing to do with the fact that your shit was stolen from you and you were kicked out of your house or left on the street with nothing but the clothes on your back hmm? and then thrown into one of the previous images that I showed you. It's got nothing to do with that and everything to do with your mindset. Thank you, I finally understand. I appreciate it. So I wonder how many white people live there in um, in Mellenberg and in, in, in Hanover Park. Um, and I wonder how many white people mindsets uh, live in in, in, in uh, Kailicha and in uh, Nyanga Junction. Um, and I wonder how many white people uh, live in Sea Point. Well, I wonder how many black people, colored people, and Indian people live in Sea Point and in uh, 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 Constantia and in Newlands. And are you going to say, but I, I have seen colored people there, yes, but what is the percentile? Hmm? What is the percentage of white people that live in those privileged areas? And what is the percentage of black and colored people? Hmm? This was a mindset. I'm sorry, bro. I, I, I got it all wrong. So apart, it was just a mindset. I am so sorry. I got it all wrong. My whole existence is... <sighs> Yo, I need to question my whole existence now. Thank you very much for this very eye-opening comment. I really appreciate it.